The overall goal of this procedure is to isolate engaged in translation RNA in a cell-type specific manner in Drosophila embryos. This is accomplished by first collecting embryos from a transgenic fly line, allowing specific expression of a GFP-tagged ribosomal subunit in the targeted cell type, in this case, the slouch muscle cells. The second step is to generate a lysate to obtain a polysome preparation containing a mixture of tagged and untagged ribosomes. Next, the protein concentration in the lysate is estimated and affinity purification is performed with beads coupled to GFP antibodies to capture ribosome RNA complexes from the cell type of interest. The final step is dedicated to trisol RNA extraction and purification. Ultimately, quality and specificity assessments are performed with a bioanalyzer and RT-QPCR respectively. RNA can then be used for global quantitative analysis by RNA sequencing or microarrays. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods like fax sorting is that it does not require a laborious step of cell dissociation. It can be performed on the bench, it's fast, and allows direct identification of translated RNA in very small population of cells, which is a major benefit for the understanding of the acquisition of cell properties. Even if this method can provide insight into myogenesis in drosophila embryo, it can be also applied to other tissue or modern organisms, such as plant, zebrafish, or mouse, and could also help following impact of treatment on protein synthesis. In